In a response to the attacks and kidnappings of Westerners in war-torn Iraq and Afghanistan, MS Instruments developed a system that provides immediate countermeasures. Easily fitted to any car, the Nimbus non-lethal deterrent vehicle protection system comprises a series of covertly fitted pyrotechnic devices that are deployed from within the car at the touch of a button. The system distracts and disorientates the assailants and deprives them of their advantage. Nimbus gives the edge back to the victims, whilst causing minimal harm to innocent bystanders. In this reenacted scenario, a VIP is travelling in a standard two-car convoy. The convoy is compromised and comes under fire. Deploying only smoke and sound units, the car immediately disappears from view allowing the quick transfer of personnel from the stricken car to the second vehicle. Deprived of a target to aim at, the attackers just spray the area with random fire, significantly reducing the number of hits. The VIP escapes unharmed. As well as the smoke, Nimbus also deploys sound and airburst units. Up to 10 unique pyrotechnic units can be fitted. This second reenacted scenario is called a shark attack. This is when a hostile vehicle follows and attacks from behind. It's impossible to drive deprived of all vision and the attack soon peters out. It's also a great deterrent when airbursts are exploding around your head. It's possible to select which units are deployed, a single unit, a bank left or right, the rear air units, all smoke units, all sound units, or the entire system all at once. But don't take our word for it, listen to Chris's story. On Saturday the 12th of June, we were tasked to convey the client to Anaconda in the northern area of Iraq. We departed the green zone at 0630 hours. I was in the rear vehicle of a two vehicle convoy travelling on Route 1. I noticed a black BMW in Lane 1. This BMW was tucked in amongst other slow moving traffic. As my vehicle passed alongside the BMW, I looked at the occupants and realised this was going to go live. I started to give a warning to the driver as I observed the BMW pull out into our slipstream and engage the rear of our vehicle. This became a real-time situation as I continued to give the warning we were being hit from behind. I started a radio contact report and it was doing this report that Rounds had breached the armoured glass hitting both the driver and myself. In the 35 second attack my vehicle sustained over a hundred hits with eight bullets penetrating the rear and side glass. It's my personal belief that had the vehicle been fitted with the NLD system, then the outcome would have been totally different. Yes, there are those that will argue that we would have still taken rounds. However, I believe that neither the driver nor I would have taken hits. I've been involved with this system from concept through to completion, and I know in my heart of hearts that it will save lives. <laughs>